I am Romario Williams, Jamaican national striker. Everybody, go ahead and check out Sports Down the Middle. And don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe. Welcome, Sports Nation, to Sports DTM, the sports channel where we call Sports Down the Middle. You can expect the latest in sports news, views, and reviews from our resident analysts. No sports topic is too controversial, and no team or player is above criticism. So just smash that subscribe button and ring that notification bell to make sure you don't miss out on our balanced offering of riveting sports content. And don't forget to like, share, and leave a comment below. Welcome to Sports DTM. Greetings Sports DTM fans and welcome to another episode of Sports Down the Middle, the channel of undiluted sports content. Sports DTM would like to bring into focus our very own reggae boy, Andre Gray, and his Watford team for qualifying for the Premier League next season. But before we go into the details, we see that you've been watching and liking our videos. We also want you to be part of the Sports DTM family by clicking that subscription button. If that button is still red, it simply means that you have not yet subscribed, so click that button and welcome to the Sports DTM family. So, analyst, Andre Gray will be back in the Premier League next season. What does that mean for Andre Gray and Watford? They're currently second in the championship as it draws to a close with 88 points and is sure to qualify or has already qualified for the Premier League. So, analyst Andre Gray back in the Premier League. Excited to see another reggae boy in the top level of English football. Talk to me. Yeah, man. Welcome back, Watford, and welcome back, Andre Gray. You know, he's used to the Premiership, and we're glad to have him back in the top level, playing against world-class players. He went down with Watford last year and came straight back up, which is good. Um, he spent a lot of years at Burnley as well, so he's well experienced. And we need that type of player playing at that level um, in the team. And um, didn't have a great season, 28 games in all competition, scoring four goals, one assist. I don't think the coach, Siska, really favours him. Um, but he has a year left on his contract, so hopefully next year he can try and break into this Watford team and try to play regularly. That will only help the, the regular boys. Or maybe move and get another club in the Premier League. So, good going, Andre Gray. Yes, Kurt, it's a good look. It's a good look. Andre Gray playing 28 games, uh, scoring four goals and one assist. Um, while that seemed a little low, it's good that his team has qualified for the Premier League. So, week in and week out, we can almost see him play against the top teams such as Arsenal. <laughs> Sorry, Manchester City and the Liverpools of this world, and also the possibility of um, making a push towards even Europe. I know that seems like a stretch, but the fact that Watford is back again and hope to make a serious dent, and he's a part of the team, that's great. Great, great, great. I can't, I can't be more excited to know that, as I said, Sunday in and Sunday out, we'd have a regular boy to watch and watch his progress as well. Um, yeah, and experience, you know, playing all these different types of defenders, defenders world-class players come next season. I can only bode well for playing when he plays for the regular boys and the type of experience and chemistry and you know professionalism we bring to the team you know that's that's exciting yes kurt andre gray is on his way back into the premier league watford the hornets are on their way back to the premier league this is exciting news andre gray is a is a new addition to the regular boys a hard worker someone who can add some value and it is just really good to know that he has actually gotten his way back playing at the top level um we know of his work ethic we know of his um his movement of the ball his ability to hold up the football probably not the most prolific goal scorer but you want that person to work for you with their heart and their sleeve and andre gray that person and so congrats to him and to the watchful team and we look forward to monitoring his progress over the season. Well, Kirk, that's welcoming news for, for, for Jamaica regular boys, you know? One one more of our player in the top flight of, of the English Premier League. Yeah, that's welcome news. I must say congratulations to him and his Watford team. Yeah, and I hope he bring that um that 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 bunks of qualifying 
<laughs> you understand? We like the word qualifying. Yeah, we hope you bring that bunks of qualifying. So Jamaica can also qualify for the World Cup and also um, 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 win the Gold Cup. So yeah, Andre, bring some of that good fortune to the reggae boys. We love that. We like that good news. Now you know you can lift your head high and play for the reggae boys with pride and, and, and quality. Yeah, man, welcoming news. We like it. There you have it, Sports DTM fans. Another episode of Sports Down the Middle in which we highlight our very own reggae boy, Andre Gray, recently crossed the line and, and represented the reggae boys. And he has advanced to the Premier League with his Watford team. And we just want to big him up. Congratulations to Watford. Congratulations to Andre Gray. We'll see you playing against the big boys this time around. Um, not in the Super League, but in the Premier League. And we want to say kudos to Andre Gray, kudos to Watford. Big up on yourself, Andre Gray. We look forward to seeing you next season striking out, representing the black, green and gold in the Premier League. Sports DTM fans, let us hear from you by leaving a comment in the comment section below. And always remember to like, share and to subscribe. This has been another episode of Sports Down the Middle. Be blessed.